I'm pulling plugs of emerald zoysia and some sod that we laid a few weeks ago. We waited until the sod rooted in before harvesting plugs for transplanting. The tool I'm using is called the Pro Plugger. I can take multiple plugs here at a time because the plugs stack up on the inside of the tube until it's full. The plugs that I'm pulling will be transplanted to the area you see behind me, which is about four times the area of the sod. I'm pulling my donor plugs about every three inches apart. I'm taking these plugs over to my planting area where I've already plugged out planting holes about every six inches apart. And now I'm planting them in the holes. I'm filling in these holes where I harvested the good plugs with some soil and I'll water the area including the area I transplanted well for the next couple of weeks to help both areas overcome transplant shock and start spreading. The zoysia sod area should grow back together in about six weeks and then I'll be able to repeat the process of pulling plugs to transplant to other parts of the yard. Here's what the new transplant area looks like when I'm finished. And here's another area I plugged on the other side of the house. Again, the sod where I harvest my zoysia plug should regrow in about six weeks or so and be ready to harvest more plugs for transplanting. We should see these plugs filling in about one to two full growing seasons. Here's some examples of areas that we have plugged before. This video is meant to be a brief overview of the plugging process. I'm going to make a part 2 video that will go into more step-by-step -step detail for those interested in doing the project themselves.